Is it recording? What is up, everyone? It is your boy, Razorbacks Roy, and welcome back to an SEC prediction video. This will be the final prediction vide video of this year, and our final team is going to be the Vanderbilt Commodores. The Commodores really just suck, just really weren't good last year. 2-10, and 0-8 oh in the SEC, including losses to Eastern Tennessee, Tennessee State. That, that's just embarrassing, but how... How will this team fare out this year? Well, let's look at their schedule. So here it is. They will start out in week zero on the road at Hawaii. Hawaii, the Hawaii Rainbow Warriors. Warriors. Now going on the road at Hawaii, this this could be the key game for Vanderbilt this year. Going on the road to face off Hawaii. 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 Hawaii's got had got a really good team. And this is a game that Vanderbilt can lose, but Hawaii, Hawaii is on the road, and Hawaii will be will, will really good will, will really will really show up for that game. But but I think Vanderbilt will somehow win this game on the road. Win the win this game on the road. They will somehow find a way to beat Hawaii on the road. And if if Mike Wright starts, I think Vanderbilt will will somehow get a late miracle and win the game. Then they get Elon at home. I think that's going to be easy win. But then I get to say that last year too. Eh. They lost East Tennessee State, so ah, uh, so so yeah, so yeah. But I think Vanderbilt will easily win that game. Then they get Wake Forest at home. Home Wake Forest is, was so good last year. And they're and they're getting some, and they have a lot of talents. I don't see Vanderbilt winning this game. I think Vanderbilt takes an L right there. Then they go on the road at Northern Illinois. Northern Illinois, the Huskies of Northern Illinois. I don't really know much about Northern Illinois, but it is on the road. But I think Vanderbilt will go on the road and get that win, get that win, and move to three and one on the new year. So three and one, that's a really good start. Then you get to the SEC schedule, go on the road at Alabama. They're just too good. That's a loss. They get Ole Miss at home. Ole Miss is going to be a really good team this year. I don't see Vanderbilt winning that game as well. Going on the road at Georgia, it's Georgia. Vanderbilt's going to lose that game. And then they go on the road at Missouri. If Vanderbilt was going to – I'll tell you what. If Vanderbilt's going to win an SEC game this year, it's going to be Missouri. And I mean not to brag on Brady Cook. I think Brady Cook's a really good quarterback. But if Vanderbilt were to win an SEC game this year – it, it'll be on the road at Missouri, Missouri. But I, I think Missouri will so will will win this one. Then they get South Carolina at home, coming home to get and Spencer Rattler and Shane Beamer just coming into this game, coming into this game. I mean, I think this this will be a loss for Vanderbilt. They go on the road at Kentucky. Kentucky's a really good team. I don't see see I don't see them winning that game either. Florida at home. That's going to be a loss. And then they finally get Tennessee. Tennessee. Tennessee is going to be so good next year. Next year. Tennessee has a lot of talent. And I think Vanderbilt's going to lose this game. That means Vanderbilt will finish off the season 3-9. and 0-8 in the SEC. So, sorry if I... Sorry if that prediction was quick, everybody. So, But I just... The real point of this team is... They got to find their identity at quarterback. It's either going to be Mike Wright. They got to find their identity. I mean, Ken Seals returning at, returning at quarterback is one positive thing. No, nope, but reality, they got to find their identity at quarterback. Quarterback. It's either going to be Mike Wright or Ken Seals. Seals. The best case scenario, Vanderbilt's best case scenario is 4 and 8. They go on the road and beat Missouri. And finish off the season four and eight, and you know, and future star and look bright. Fan bro. Worst case scenario is one and eleven. They lose on the road to Hawaii. They lose. They lose on the road to Northern Illinois. Illinois. Northern Illinois, and their only wins against Elon, 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 Elon. But, but. Clark Lee is going to have to find out this identity at their quarterback. It's either going to be Mike Wright or Ken Seals. But even if – but I see the best-case scenario for Vanderbilt to get in 3-9 is starting Mike Wright. Mike Wright's a really good quarterback, but 
I think he can lead this Vanderbilt team to a three and nine season. But sorry, Vanderbilt fans, three and nine. That's that. But three and nine is a is is the record for y'all. That's gonna be it for my SEC prediction b- prediction videos. I will release the SEC prediction standings out probably around probably around Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday or so. So before, before school starts. So thank you all so much for watching. Peace out.